I told the congregation, don't ask for anything. It was when I was standing up, we were to sing. We were singing and singing and singing and singing. It wasn't looking like Thursday revival hour. We were singing. I sang the Hebrew song. I sang English song. I we sang from in book like that and like that. Forget about your trouble. Forget about your problem. Forget about the challenges you have gone through. Forget about all of those things that are befalling you or that came against you this year. Just sing. And as we were running, then we pray. And so what am I saying? Try praises. I do that. Try praises. Sing. Worship God. Glorify God. Behave as if nothing had happened. Behave as if you don't even have any challenge. Behave as if there is no negativity around you or in your family. And I tell you, the power of praise, the power of worship, the power of singing, the benefit <laughs> to people that worship God in the beauty of holiness We come to you in Jesus' name. Let's practice it very quickly as we go to the next session. How are you, Yo Baba? How are you, Yo Baba? How are you, Yo? How are you, Yo Baba? How are you, Baba? Thank you, sir. Praise our Lord. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. If you can hear the sound of my voice, give me a louder hallelujah. Hallelujah. The few, the few minutes we have, I want you to please bow down your head as we go to the presence of the Lord. I want you to tell the Lord that this year, we are rounding up this year, this very day. I want you to tell the Lord there will be no carryover in my life. For everything that God needs to do, he will do it this very year. For every right. failure in the past, I am not carrying it to 2023. Somebody open your mouth, lift up your voice, and begin to tell the Lord. Father, am I God? Anything that is not of your will, anything that you have not deleted, you have not planned, you have not imposed into my life. Lord, as I'm ending this year, today, there shall not be carry over in my life, carry over in the life of my children, carry over in my family. In anything that you Oh God, everything that you have not died into my life, but 2023 is coming that will be out of order. Also, ever it is not of you, oh Lord, now bring about new things, now bring about new going now bring about new things, 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 now b
Lift up your voice, lift up your voice to heaven. We are praying in the new year. The Lord will be glorified in the mighty name of Jesus. We are praying for the new year. Oh Lord, in the new year, the new year, I will be set. The new year, I will be planted. The new year, I will be strengthened. The new year, I will be strengthened. In the mighty name of Jesus, Lord, I pray for God. Somebody lift up your voice. I thought I would hear it loud. Let your have desire will be granted. Let the way they don't be established. God would not like to see you in this position. Jesus, and you Lord can grow better. You can, be better you can be better spiritually. You can be better physically. You can be better in all aspects of life. In all aspects of your life. Lord, in the name of Jesus. My Lord, my God, 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 my let Jesus Christ be Let Jesus Christ be exalted for God in the name of Jesus. All the glory to God is If you have said amen, then let me hear a powerful amen. 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 I pray for you. In this new year, you will not borrow. Amen. 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 The Holy Spirit will open the windows of heaven and you will be a giver. Amen. The name of Jesus. I pray for you that the Holy Spirit will penetrate into your family and touch your children one after the other in the name of Jesus. Amen. 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 And every invader into your family, that the Holy Spirit will flush them out in the name of Jesus. Amen. 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 Every tree Amen. That my father has not planted shall be rooted up. Now every Amen. tree of sorrow, every tree of sickness, 
every tree of pain, of calamity, I hope put them now in the name of Jesus. Amen. Amen. Now in the name of Jesus. Amen. 2023 will be a year of service. A Amen. year Amen. can be fulfilled in your life. In Amen. the name of Jesus. Amen. Amen. For you. That what costs you pain, what brings pain from your life in 2022 will bring you joy in 2023. In Amen. the name of Jesus. I pray that thing you have been asking God for. And you prayed and prayed and prayed is not coming. I pray right now you are receiving it now into the new year. Amen. You will receive it now in the name of Jesus. Amen. I pray this 2023, you will not lose your salvation. You will not lose your sanctification. You will not lose the gift of God for your life in the name of Jesus. Amen. Amen. That is scheduled. In 2023, not one of them will go and fulfill it in the name of Jesus. Amen. Holy Spirit, I pray now that you will bless everyone. Amen. Everyone hearing the sound of my voice now, release blessings upon them, release upon their family, release upon everything that concerns them in the name of Jesus. Amen. Amen. I pray, Lord, that there will be revival in our church. Amen. The gate of hell will not prevail in our church in the name of Jesus. Amen. Amen. We thank Amen. you, blessed Father. We thank, thank you, Lord. Holy Savior. Because thank we know you have answered our prayer. For yes, in Lord. Jesus' mighty name we are praying. Amen. 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 Yes. To have Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. He is looking to this very, very instructive. God said that to tell somebody that in your life, bitterness has been removed. Amen. Every form of bitterness in your life goes away in Jesus' name. Amen. 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 He said, son of man, prophesy. I want you to make a word of prophecy. Into this coming year, how do you want this coming year to be for you? Open your mouth and talk to God in prayer. Open your mouth and pray. Open your mouth and pray. Prophesy. Into the new year. Prophesy. Into the new year. What do you want to do in the new year? Let Holy Spirit of God take over my life. My love, the Holy Spirit of God, take over my life. The Lord, take over my life. The totality of my excess. The totality of me. My God, kill. My reasons, what is my idea? Lord, I pray, keep waiting to enter my spirit of God. We take absolute control over my life in the name of Jesus. Lord, take control over my life in the name of Jesus. Lord, take control over my life in the name of Jesus. Every plan, every plan, 
Over our lives, According to the Bible, in the book of Numbers, chapter six, verse fifty-four to twenty-six. The Lord bless thee. Amen. And keep thee. Amen. The Lord make his face to shine upon thee. Amen. 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 And be gracious unto thee. Amen. The Lord lift up his countenance upon thee. Amen. Amen. And give thee peace. Amen. Amen. It's done in Jesus' name. Pastor Matthew, please. Amen. Pastor Matthew. Over to Pastor Matthew, Apostolic Benediction. <laughs> Apostolic Blessing, Ada. Pastor Matthew, over to you, sir. <clears throat> Is Pastor Matthew there? Pastor Matthew? Hello, Pastor He's Matthew. He's online, sir. OK. Maybe he's having an issue with the system, but he's online. He chatted me just a few minutes ago now. Okay. Aki Omi, please call Pastor Matthew. Aki Omi. Oh, my God. 
And uh, many people must be observing. Anytime we are in program, uh, I do publicity, I do the recording, uh, and I, mostly I come from the work. To be sincere, I was the one that wake up your child this morning. By the time, so everything was just too, uh, too what language can I see clumsy for me to do? So I have to abandon joining you physically, make sure everybody is able to hear one another. So I am very sorry for that. I do all what I can do to join us. But still, I still have some time. Uh, I was expecting uh, the organizer to involve all, uh, some of, not some, all of them, our wives, they have been the beneficiary of this program. And I am surprised that it's only the uh, the usual forces we have been hearing before. We are still okay. listening to. Uh, to me, there's nothing so special there in the Thanksgiving of today. And then I want the organizer to look at it that at the middle of the year, by the power and the blood of Jesus Christ, we are going to redo it in a way that we. I think uh, one of the things that I see that affects it is the global crusade, which we thank Almighty God for. All of us, we are. Uh, beneficiary of the program. Uh, another thing which every one of us know uh, is the absence of Pastor Dada that I always want him to be there. Uh, now, all of us know the system in Deepa Labiagui Church. He has not seen us. All of us are pastors. In order for pastors to engage in a program you need to able to uh maybe talk to them before or talk to their state overseer or their region overseer that will make it very difficult for me to bring him in this year because the program has been big and it's like those people who make the law they should not break the law so that one make me very um i don't want to say unhappy but because by the grace of the Lord, we have many reasons to thank God, and uh, He knows about all what we have been doing. 
And then pray by God will help us more in Jesus' name. And for, I want us to take note of all those. Our, our, all our mothers, let them be involved. The first uh, social program, let hear the force of uh, Mrs. Somarewa. I said the fall of Mrs. Shegun. And by the power and the blood of Jesus Christ, uh, you will hear the force of my wife too. By the power and the blood of Jesus Christ. The third thing I observe is that is it thanksgiving. I'm surprising that many of us we are still requesting. We are still requesting for many things. I'm not expecting that. Uh, and I believe by the power and the blood of Jesus Christ, by the time we shall do it in the mid of the year 2023, all of us we are going to be present in Jesus' name. Amen. Amen. Half is first Amen. just singer from your uh, uh from your church. That means from your okay, please bring them in. Let it let it be special. Let it be special. Uh imagine you just were there and you are going to your in-law house to go and show appreciation. You know, you will be in the best of your clothes. So we're supposed to have been in the best today. Uh, you may not know, many things are happens in this prayer meeting. And then pastor, your main pastor, Ali, I know you go to work as meeting or preparing for the, but please bear with me. We need to praise the name of the Lord. For what God has done. From me, here, you will not believe. That's why that how big the program is. It's only me, by the grace of the Lord. Your son is becoming, uh, it's entering thin now, a lot of things have been occupying his mind. But it's only me and him. Financially, physically, organizing the program. My dear father, if you know how far this program has gone, you will understand. I was discussing with one of our pastors in North Carolina. I don't know if I shared that testimony. I said, how are you managing? Immediately within five seconds, he sent one thousand dollars. Wow! That I want to be using it to assist you, to let you know how. But understand? I don't know how. Uh, area the load is. I won't be. I won't deceive me. I won't be. I mean, deceive you. Many times I will be coming from the work, then to come and to come and be operating the machine, do everything. And by the power and the blood of Jesus Christ, all of you are the testimony. We have never failed one day to uh to fail, I mean fail to do the program and all other things which all the leaders know. So we have to praise the name of the Lord for that. And I pray that by the power and the blood of Jesus Christ. God will continue to strengthen all our leaders. And then that's why I want everyone of them to be online. I'm seeing Pastor Mai, Pastor, I can't see Pastor uh, Peter. I don't know if he's online. I can't see him. I don't know if it's Pastor Ali that spoke but before I spoke. Uh, so that one is there. You know, here in this prayer meeting, no more, no one, no two people have been kidnapped. And we pray upon the name of the Lord, and they were released. Can you remember? Very it correct, is, sir. It, it is on this prayer meeting. There's a testimony I can never forget. I don't know if I share it with any of the leader. One couple for more than 12 years, they have married. More than 12 years. They have married. No single baby. It was on this prayer meeting. God answered their prayer. And then I did as if we didn't bother. We didn't know. You know what? Last month, that man called me. 
He forced me. He said, <laughs> this, is, this is your son. I want you, I want you to send to this boy. Because the boy came through the prayer online here. Because I, I just caught them and I greeted them and I did a lot of things and then I just and I closed the chapter. And then I've been looking. He said, even if it is ten dollar, even if this one dollar, I want you to send. I say, I don't know, in my language, be one be baba someone. You are the father of this child. And even just one dollar, I want you to send to this boy as a significance of that the child come through this prayer. That's a loss. Ah, uh, Pastor Dapo is there. You know a lot of things you have faced. That one let me come. I was facing some battle. I know I'm taking our time, but this is what I was expecting us to do. Pastor Mike, then this one issue have been more than the request and praises because we call it Thanksgiving, end of the year. Uh, I was facing a lot of battle. Many people that you move near me, you know. My GS, we say, you say you are a Christian, you are not facing battle. Why can't you call me? So I share my battle with you. And by the grace of the Lord, I know many of you have shared my battle with me. I don't want to use as a, uh, I don't want to use word leader. All of you are my leader. But I praise the name of the Lord, but you never leave me alone. Then I have <laughs> a, a pastor from another denomination. We always talk together. Very close to me, more than I can say. Many of you online is close to uh, closer to me. And then suddenly I just saw him. In fact, it was the genesis of my coming to United States because it was the one that filled my visa lottery form to let you know how close so we are. And then we are I'm a man of battle. I'm not, if this is the first time I will tell you, I'm very sorry, I'm not boasting. My life has been a, a life of battle on the Christian journey. And then I just saw him. He was not calling me again. He stopped. And I said, what can happen? Then, then, then I started looking to all what I can do. I couldn't see. And I said, okay. And now I, I used my brain. I said, Pastor, please do not leave me in deep battle. I'm not hearing from you. Now, he said, Pastor Matthew, the attack is too much for me on your situation. He said, every time we are discussing about your matter or we are talking about your matter, this is what happened. Financially, children and everything, he said, they suffer for it. And as a result of that, I want to call it. Play he may be hearing me now. Plainly, he said, I want to cut my relationship. You know, this is a person that we, to let you know how closer we are. Okay, if you are cutting your relationship, me. He said, Ah, I know Larry, but this is not the first time. Many people have told me like that. My dear brother, my dear sister, it is on this prayer. Sometimes, if you know the kind of person, I'm not saying you should copy me to even pray in the morning because I walk in the night. And then, you know, when you are walking in the night, your morning has turned to afternoon. Afternoon has turned to morning. And then to sleep become a, become a problem. So to even have a quiet time, it's a problem. But by the power and the blood of Jesus Christ, I've never, you are the witness. I've never missed any of this prayer. There's something God done in my ministry. Through this prayer, you may not know. I've told you about all my weaknesses. English, uh, money, poor family, everything. But the power and the blood of Jesus, I've told you. But go and look at our YouTube. Go and look at anybody that have YouTube and they are, they are carrying on the, uh, 
assignment God has given to our GS by spreading his ministry. If in United States, if we see anybody that are subtrawers like us, I doubt it. And then God used us to go in into the messages. I received messages from Belgium. From Britain, from all the call, all those who are very close to the GS. And then by the time I state everything about them, you won't believe recently. One of our GS, a clo I mean, uh, I'll call them Lieutenant, he introduced me to uh, to the left more than 1,000 messages was sent again for Lagos. My dear brother, my dear sister, is through this ministry. Financially, I know, I think, and please, it's not pride. Let me, let me, this is what I was expecting. I was expecting everyone for to share the testimony. Yes, Pastor Omarewa went into him a little bit. I think it was only Pastor Omarewa. Pastor Shegun, too, went into, into him it, a little bit. All the members, we didn't allow them. To share the testimony. Have you forgotten one of our mother that every day we have to be praying for him on this online? We mention his name. What happened? He passed that array that he has been doing for many, many years. Have you forgotten? That's very true. That's, that's very true. Very true. No, let us let us be sincere. I was expecting more than this. Online about today's prayer. Ah, uh, you remember this when we shared the testimony this year. I told us when Pastor Dada asked us a question, and uh, he said, I answered the question, and he said, By the power and the blood of Jesus Christ, you will become a please do not misquote me. I'm sharing what God has done. And then Pastor Dada said. You will become a multi. I mean, no, don't let me. You will become a millionaire. And then I think I didn't that month something happened. Then my first time I eat. Let please with humility. I'm not telling you what God has done. I eat one million. I normally of course want one million, but don't forget my own background. Million is money. <laughs> then I know. Please let me use this million that come to an end of this year. It will this all this prayer. So, and I pray by the power and the blood of Jesus Christ, all God that have done it, have done to many of us online, which we know. Uh, and I was expecting us to have a full of a blow of praises. Shouting of hallelujah, and then pray the, like first time when we, when we did it. And then, for many of us we, 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 you, that you know that I should eat with your son, you know what God did for him. Pastor Mariba, can I hear your yes? I know again, yes, sir, yes, sir. Uh, I can on me exactly. No, it took a lot of things. A lot of things, and I know God did it in our own family too. So please, Pastor Mike, when we are coming back in June uh, or end of June or beginning of July, let us really prepare for the testimony, not for any other thing, because God appreciates our gratitude than when we are always. Do this for me. Do this for me. From from the from the night something now, they will give us paper again that we should fill. We started again. It never ends. That this is what I want. This is what I want. This is what I want. This. Then another thing I want us to know, God has used this prayer meeting to keep many of us spiritually. You know, an empty heart. God, devil uses a lot. But by the time you're thinking that, oh, 
I have this prayer this time around. I have this prayer in that. How can that devil ask opportunity to come to that empty hand? It's not possible. It's not possible. And this is a lot of things I want us to see that God have done. So praising the Lord. Oh. Always, please let us sing. Let us promote our praising the Lord. Always praising the Lord. Let anybody go 
without the blessing of the Lord as I was assigned. And then the first thing that come onto my mind is that my sister wipe away your tears. Amen. Many of us that you see that we are sharing testimony, it's not because of our righteousness. I want to tell you, it's not because we know how to pray. It's not because we dedicate our time unto God. It's not because there's a special Holy Spirit. All out of all those things, come and check my life. They are zero upon zero. As called, I'm not deceiving you. But it is by the grace. And I want to tell you, my sister, wipe away your tears. You will achieve your goal in Jesus' name. Amen. 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 The Bible, let me know. God used something that is powerless, that has no power, that has no anything to prove himself that he can do this. Because if he has used the mighty one, the glory might have not been given unto him. But if he seen the mighty one that surrender himself to him, instead of achieving less, they achieve multiple. So do not think that it's because you come from a humble family, do not think because you don't have Holy Spirit, yes, it's part of the journey. Do not think because you are you don't know how to pray. Do not think because you have no money. Do not think of you have no anybody on the on the on top. It's just the mercy of the Lord. It is on that level. On that grace, I'm very sorry to say this, that on many people, you have known your servants. I share a testimony whereby even after I finished my HND and I was working as a personal assistant, I can mention name. The, the man is all uh, uh, of Farah now. I was his personal assistant in, the, in Lagos. Instead of Ari, I mention Irene. Yeah, I am today. <laughs> if I don't speak English where I am today, I cannot eat. Recently, they were talking to my child. I'm just sharing the mercy of the Lord. I'm not boasting. They are asking my child, why did your father ask you that this name? If you didn't, he didn't know. I give him that name to remember somebody that can never forget in my life. And then he was talking that, oh, you know, my dad has a very big accent. And I remember whenever I'm in the office, when other people see the way I be as to in 2006, you see the way I'm still speaking. I'm still speaking like my farmer. I don't care. No matter whom you hear, when I come before you, by the time I use my hand, I use my leg, I use my head, you will understand what I'm saying. It doesn't bother me. It doesn't bother Not that I don't want to change, but I always appreciate God for who I am. I want you to know that the mercy of the law exists forever and ever. It is on that note, by the power in his blood, I come in agreement with every one of us that online today, the mercy of the Lord will follow you in Jesus' name. Amen. Anywhere you are, anywhere you be, before the king, before the poor, 
You know, the poor people, they even help others. This morning, I was coming. And then, by the grace of the Lord, I, I, there's a lot of ceremony I will have shared. You know, all of you know, I had four accidents this year. Four! Two times. Okay. Okay. I mean, element, I mean, right off. Yeah, right off. Ah. The car was right off. I'm very sorry to take your time. But this is the kind of the testimony I was expecting. I wouldn't have had time to share all this testimony. But I want you to know that God answered our prayer on this online. Not anything we might have achieved, any one of us, all the leaders, not by our power, not because of our intelligence, but because of the grace of the Lord for us. I said you will receive mercy from the gray, from the poor, from the rich, from whatsoever you meet. Today I was coming. And then I said, well, the person I was working with, by the grace of the Lord, I told you, they just create a leadership that was not in my office. And I was selected among those people who are faithful. And then one of those that were working with us just called me today. I have not even opened the bag, but I see many shoes. We are working together. It's not my boss. It's not my boss. That's the kind of the mercy I was telling you. That anywhere you go, by the power and the blood of Jesus Christ, every one of us, including your children, they will receive mercy in Jesus' name. Amen. Letter of mercy. Mm -hmm. From where no one has ever expected. From where you have never expected, by the power and the blood that we read the coup, the powerful man, the mighty man in your family, in any area of, 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 of life, that we read the coup, then God will give it to everyone of us, including me in Jesus' name. Amen. Amen. Letter to come to the United States through the visa lottery. I was joking with my boss. I said, take me to America. I said, I will put you under the bag, inside the bag. He was just playing. Not that. You get what I'm saying? I have a friend. Maybe he's listening now. He's in Abuja. He told me that anytime he is on puppies, he used my life to preach that there's nothing God cannot do. Then I told him that I won visa lottery to America. He said it's not possible. I'm telling you, he said it's not possible. I think many people, about two people like that, to be excited that because I was so unhappy for two weeks, we were very close. I didn't talk to him because I believe he thought nothing good can never come from my own. That's right. If God can do it for me, the least of all of you, many of you, you are a graduate, you are speaking better English. Many of you, you know the skill about business. Many, I, I see, I have that, I see, another testimony see come to me now. By the power and the blood of Jesus Christ, everything will open for everyone of us under this ministry in Jesus' name. Amen. Can you hear Amen. 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 You think I'm not good enough to pray, but that anointing is not there. But I'm saying because of the authority that has been given to me by the leaders. And as a result of that, I said, the mercy beyond mercy. Mm -hmm. As you start this year by the power and the blood of Jesus Christ, anywhere you go, anywhere your son go, your children go, anywhere your wife go, by the power and the blood of Jesus, they will receive mercy in Jesus' name. Amen. It is not how much, how many, how the matter of what you have. When, uh, please, I'm taking your time. Yes, anybody that wants to, I know we have workers missing. But please, give me about five minutes more. This year. I, I started, I want to let people, everybody believe that when you are in United States, you need to build a house. 
And then, okay. I started to face me and face you because my mommy was worried that United States is too much. Come home. Even the first, you know, it was she was selling water. She doesn't know what money is. And if, that's why that, that thing does not uh, worth it. I decided, I, I started that with, with my face. I can't tell you the third time I was not prepared. I was not prepared. My first dog gather. I believe you will not believe me. I'm boasting. Okay. But I want you to know by the power and the blood of Jesus, no matter what the case may be, every one of us will receive mercy in Jesus' name. Amen. Not the matter of you have any background or somebody is going to give you money or no. When God ready to open the way, he will use somebody you do not know. He will use what you think it is irrelevant to take you up. And that's what message I want to say to you today. By the time you shall lean down beside your bed, with all what I've told you, with how I've shared the testimony, if from this word, testimony is not worthy enough, I want you to lean down before your bed and look at that thing and say, God, if you can do it for this poor, the poorer man, why are you not going to do, to do my own? By the power in the blood of Jesus Christ, for everyone that say amen this morning, including me, everyone will open for you in the name of Jesus Christ. Amen. You will not look into hand before you eat in the name of Jesus. Amen. Another testimony to come to my mind. By the power in the blood, you will not lack in the name of Jesus Christ. Amen. 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 You will not know the source of your revenue in the name of Jesus Christ. Amen. By the power of the blood of Jesus Christ, as a pastor, I pray, you will continue to be giver and not a beggar in the name of Jesus Christ. Amen. Amen. Anywhere you go, I will tell people, there are some things I want to do. But because the, the Bible says the mark of the Lord is on me, the mark of the Lord will continue to be upon you in Jesus' name. Raise their eyes to look unto you. They will look out to have mercy upon whatsoever belongs unto you in Jesus' name. Because you have no any other one. It's only Jesus. And nobody can see Jesus except they see the mercy of the Lord in, the, in you. By the power and the blood, anywhere you go, you will receive mercy in Jesus' name. Amen. The name of the Lord will continue to be praised in your life in the name of Jesus Christ. Amen. Who can it be? In Amen. Jesus' name, we pray. Amen. Amen. Pastor Yomi, you can add the horse or oh, share the thank you, sir. Oh, Pastor Mike. No, that you have you have done it too. So we should just share the good. Pastor Bani to give us both of that. Eh, uh -huh. Pastor Bani, exactly. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. So, so on behalf of the on behalf of all the pastors and the brothers and sisters, you would like to you know thank our leader. Uh, Pastor Mighty, for this prayer for this prayer platform, and having kept the prayer the prayer platform running, and we thank God for the strength and the grace and the power that is given unto us. No, there, are so, there were so many occasions the devil tried to infiltrate. You know, sometimes we see people try to connect with all this porno and all, all, all those things, but yet still we never got discouraged. No. To me, this platform will be a, a, a sort of blessing unto me. And I know that all those people who are connected, they too, I believe that this platform has been a blessing unto them. And on behalf of those who are connected to this platform, we are expressing our thanks, not only to our, our leader, Pastor Matthew, but to Pastor, all the pastors, Pastor Yomi, Pastor Ali, Pastor Depo, Pastor Mike, Pastor Shegun, and all the pastors who have kept this platform running. You now we thank God for their lives. And then we are so appreciative, you know, a pastor, a years, a years was saying something like, you know, 10 times better. You no, know, we believe 
And because we believe you know, that this 2023, Amen. Every, everything about this platform is going to be 10 times better. Amen. Oh. So we thank God for all the Lord, oh. what the Lord have done, and is going to do in our lives. In Jesus' name. Amen. 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 Um, because of um, the foregoing, next week after this, let all the pastors be here. Um, by the grace of God, God sharing our life. If Jesus has not come, all our wives will be the ones to moderate next week after this. So we start with that. And uh, let's also prepare. We are not going to wait until the middle of the year before we share the testimony. Because I was not able to share my testimony, even though because I have. And I wish to share my screen with everybody so you can see how wonderful God is. So next week, Saturday, by the grace of God, we can also set that apart for only. And uh, we want all our wives to be connected. And those who are here to marry, this year, we will shop your eyes. Amen. 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 Let's share the grace. One, two, three, go. The grace of God. Jesus Christ. 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 Christ.